down here, I'll show you guys. She's a Mona Lisa. Everyone's not in. Hey everyone, welcome back to Ladies of Lavender. Thank you so much for joining me today. If you're new here, make sure to subscribe and like to join the Ladies of Lavender family. Okay guys, so for today's video, we have something really special for you guys. So today we're gonna talk about what to wear when you're swimming on your period. See you walking down the boulevard. She got the pass. Okay, so we don't necessarily recommend wearing a pad while swimming just because pads are made out of a very absorbent material and submerging it in water like in a pool or at the beach, it will leave no room to absorb fluids from your menstrual cycle. Okay, so there are a lot of products that you can choose from when you're swimming on your period. One of the most common ones are tampons. So I know that a lot of you guys might be scared of tampons and they might concern you. So there are definitely a lot of other options, but tampons are really cool and useful when you're swimming on your period. So always remember that it's absolutely fine if you're not comfortable using a menstrual cup or a tampon. I myself have never been comfortable using them and it does not reflect badly upon you if you're not comfortable as well. Yeah, exactly. Don't feel like you have to wear tampons. It's not necessary at all when you're swimming. So you've never used tampons? Nope. So what do you do when you go swimming? Me? Yeah, do you wear a pad? I usually just don't go <laughs> So, I'm so a wimp, okay? <laughs> So we've already made a video talking about tampons, so if you're really interested in tampons, you can go and watch that video after you watch this one. So tampons are a really good option because they are inserted inside your body, so they're concealed and they're not obvious that you're wearing them like a pad. It's pretty obvious that you're wearing it. We don't have one with us, but Tampax offers this compact size tampon that's really small and you can hold it in your fist and conceal it. So if you're really anxious and you don't want anyone to know that you're on your period, then that might be a really good option for you. The tampon is really simple. You just simply like pop it into place once, you're, once you've opened it and it works just like a normal tampon. It just is compact. But again, we made a video talking all about tampons, how to insert a tampon, how to choose your brand and size of tampons. So if you think that tampons are a good option for you, make sure to check out that video. Another really great option are menstrual cups. So just like tampons, I know that a lot of you are very hesitant to use menstrual cups because they are inserted just like tampons, but they are so useful and they last way longer than tampons. But if you want to use menstrual cups, I personally have used menstrual cups a few times. I can't say that I'm a huge fan of them yet because I have not mastered the skill with menstrual cups, sadly. <laughs> But um, so I would definitely suggest getting Hello. This is such a great menstrual cup brand. They have a ton of different sizes and colors. So I know that you guys probably can't see them from all the way over there, but it's they're pretty small. They're a little bit smaller than my palm. And this is the small slash medium, but they also have a teen sized cup. So the other thing is they come in these really cute like little linen bags. So they're always fresh and clean. And once b before you use it, sorry, you boil it for three minutes to make sure that they're sterile. And then after you use it, you boil it for another three minutes. Um, but this is a teen cup. It's also, it's way smaller. Um, so, you know, maybe try it. You know, it doesn't hurt to try if you, um, maybe you're more scared to use tampons. So I know that we already talked about menstrual cups last week, but in case you didn't watch that video, the other really awesome thing about menstrual cups is that they are 100% reusable. So another great thing about menstrual cups is that you don't have to bring a spare with you wherever you go. All you have to do is empty the blood out into the toilet and then you can reinsert it and use it again. So another great option is period swimwear, which is a lot less scary for someone who's not quite as comfortable using tampons or a menstrual cup. So I did some research a few days ago to look into different swimwear companies that offer these kinds of swimsuits. And a really great company that I found is Ruby Love. The so Ruby Love offers a ton of different period swimsuits. 
And what we mean by period swimsuits, they're literally swimsuits that you don't have to wear any other product while wearing. So Ruby Love offers this optional pad pocket in the swimsuits for extra protection. So if you have a heavy flow, but you're really interested in using these period swimsuits, I would definitely recommend buying one of their reusable pads so you can put it in the pad pocket so you have that extra protection. So Ruby Love has a huge assortment of different types of swimsuits. You definitely will not be limited in the choices that you have. They have one pieces, tan bikinis, bikinis, anything you could possibly want. So I know what I've experienced a lot is when I go swimming, maybe at a friend's house, and all of a sudden I get some really bad cramps. So you want to make sure that you're prepared in case you get cramps when you're swimming. So we definitely recommend having a small bag with you that has Advil, Tylenol, or Midol in it, just so that you can always be prepared. And that goes for any of the period products. If you use a tampon, it's a really good idea to pack an extra one just in case. Love.